Hey everyone, I'm back at it. Look what I did. I sure did. I did my very first Halloween pocket letter. Um, and it's actually my first, um, my third, excuse me, um, pocket letter. And I just started, I think, two days ago. Can you not tell? I'm really enjoying this. So I still have some things to add in it, but I actually just got done with this. So I wanted to share it with you ladies. Um, I'll remind you guys, I absolutely, I'm a beginner. I'm just going any which way, um, you know, just working with the stuff that I already have. Um, but I do want to go out and get a few more things, um, you know, just for pocket letters. So... And I just, you know, I'm working with the stuff that I already have and uh, I'd share it with you guys. So first of all, I took the, I bought these packets of Halloween confetti from where I get these Walmart for like 97 cents. And I figured I'd get the twine I got from the Dollar Tree and just kind of hang them through the holes. I thought that looked kind of funky, you know, just dangling uh, well not even dangling just tied a little bow on it so that's what i did with those and uh, i don't know it's just halloweeny um uh, the paper that i used are all the cardstock you know the papers um i actually just got the black one in uh, a white one so i had used all my cardstock actually it's the recollection packets so as you can see, I used a lot of blacks and orange. Um, I had tons of uh, stickers too. So this is this one. You can't see it in the background, but I used the black polka dotted paper and then I tried to do like a flag styled with a solid black and just glued on top, but the stickers kind of canceled that out. So that's what I did with this one. Just put some, you know, Halloween stickers on it. And then I got these, where are they from? Uh, Jolie's. Uh, it's a packet of four of these Halloween banners. It just says Happy Halloween. And I put that on top of the cover. I thought that looked kind of cute. And then I'm using some of my, I don't even know what those things are called. You see that? You guys can see that. She's pretty scary. What do you call that? Um, I don't know, but I bought them from Michael's. And you get a pack of six, I believe. So I added that, and I actually used a piece of the cardstock, but I used to cover it is the Walmart's washi tape, you know, just to give it that look. So and then I just set this uh, sticker on top of that, and then over here I really like this one. So what I did, I used a piece of orange cardstock, and then I got another piece of black, just cut it and glue the uh, black cardstock on top of the orange one. I have some of the Halloween um, ribbon that I got from Michaels. So I put a piece up there, just glued it. And you can see there's still some rough edges to this. But I also just bought a, a, a packet of spiders, and it's from Jolie's. And I got them at Walmart, and I absolutely love them. There's those little flags. Um, yeah, there's some around here. I already hauled them in my like Walmart uh, Halloween sticker video. Well, of course, I am not going to find it because I need it. Um, anyhow, I took one of the spiders off of that and I actually used, yeah, I know, uh, some of my orange uh, cobweb. I took it from there and I was like, you know what, I got a spider. I need a little cobweb. So I kind of just uh, glued the cobweb on top of the card stack, card stock paper, and added the spider. So that's what I did with that one. This one I kind of made a pocket and just stuck that uh, skull confetti inside the pocket. And then I had, I have a packet of those spiders. They're the sticko sticker spiders with the skulls on them. Little beware sign. I can. I want to still add something to this one. And then this one, again, I made a pocket, and then I used some of my uh, Halloween ribbon. I used my, rec I believe, yeah, recollection. I got a pack of bows in the Halloween section, and they are right here. I already hauled these, but I just added a bow on there, and then I put a spider confetti inside the pocket. So that's what I did with this one. This one I'm not done with. I just put some of the Halloween butterflies in there 
I'm I'm not done with this. I like I said, I still have some things to add. This one was kind of fun. You know, I says let me I put the I did the same thing. I cut the orange cardstock and glued it on top of the black. And I was like, you know what? Let me make a little pumpkin face. I know it looks kind of funky. And my phone is just like going in and out like crazy. So that's what I did. And then I put stars in the middle like his eyes. And just a boo sticker. So that's what I did with that one. This one I have and I absolutely forgot I had this. And I was like, wow, this is perfect for... I bought this skull washi tape from AC Moore um, before they closed. And it's just green and it has some gold skulls. So I just put some there and there. And then I have a pack of those skull sticko stickers. So I says, you know, whoever gets a packet letter can, if they wanted to use those skulls, they can. I didn't stick them down. But that's all I did with that one. Something just fell. Something's always fallen. And then down here again, I used the orange cardstock paper. And then I had this washi tape, Halloween washi tape from Walmart. Just, you know, just to add color to it. And then I put one of those stickers on there. And then I put some ghost stickers, some bat stickers. And then I, <laughs> I used one of my finer markers. And I kind of put cracks along the border. Just kind of make it look like it has a whole bunch of cracks in it. I don't know. I thought it was kind of fun. I'm sorry about the glare. So this is how far I got um, as far as this pocket letter. And that's the my very first Halloween one. I'm going to have to, I have so much Halloween stuff. I have to make at least one more. And I so wanted to use these stickers. And I'm going to have to use this in my next pocket letter. Because these are just too cute. These are the, and I got these from Walmart. And these are the spider stickers. And those are like blinged out spiders. So yeah, and this one is super cute, but it won't fit in a pocket litter. Maybe I can like, it's even too big probably to put, yeah, too big. Um, these ones, these are so cute. And I just might have to add some of these to that. This is the candy sticko stickers and i also got these from michael's the sugar skull stickers i didn't i wanted to use it but i said you know what let me not because i want to kind of stay with the orange black theme and i didn't want to add something like with crazy color in it but those are super cute i'm gonna have to use those um for something else so guys let me know what you guys think about this pocket letter i'm gonna share this one i'm you know remind you i'm still new I'm not done with this one, but I was kind of stuck last night on what to do um, with this pocket letter. And then one of the, you know, I don't know too much about pocket letters. And one of my subscribers says, well, did you put any goodies in the back? I'm like, well, I didn't know you had to put no damn goodies in the back in the first place. So I guess you can put some goodies in the back. And the goodies that I put back here just don't seem like it's fun goodies to me. Um, so I'm still kind of stuck to this one. So I'll share um, I put one of the stamp recollection bird stickers in there. I had two, uh, icons. I put those crowns in there because this bird has that same crown on his head. So I put two in there and I got those from Michael's. This is just a rose paper clip. This is a uh, glittered butterfly cutouts. I used my recollection butterfly cutout to make those and then to make the pink ones. And I use the glitter paper for those. These are just more butterfly uh, die cut cutouts. And some butterfly uh, ribbon that sparkles like getting all over the place. And then I just added another one of those flower or the stamp styled. Sorry about that. Stickers. And then I have some recollection ribbon. So I put some purple in there. And this is actually just like a birthday tag, but it doesn't. It has nothing about birthday on it. So I said, you know, if they need to use a little butterfly tag or something, I don't know. Um, this is another tag. It says hi. So I'm not sure. Um, I have to get some goodies to stick in these uh, pocket letters just because I don't, I just don't seem satisfied with those goodies back there. However, there's really nice, um, you know, stickers and stuff up here that I have not stuck that they can use on there. So I don't know. Throw me some. Uh, if you guys want to throw me some tips or ideas or hints, something, um, like I said, I'm this is my first, my third packet letter. Um, I am having this. Let me tell you, ladies, this takes some time. So I went to 
the Dollar Tree today. So I got home. It was pretty late. Um, so I started this when I got home and I'm just so into it, put the baby to bed, my husband's in there watching his, um, TV and I'm out here doing some pocket letters and I look at the time. I'm like, oh my goodness, there's like four hours just like pass by. So, you know, when time flies like that, you're just having fun with what you do. I just, like I say, I get in a zone. I know I'm far from a professional ladies. Um, but you know. I'll learn as I go along and I'm okay with that. So let me know what you um, you guys think or if you want to share anything with me. I always say if you haven't subscribed, please do so. I always do something on my channel. So um, I hope you all enjoy and I want to say thank you to all my um, new scribe subscribers that's coming over and to the ones that have been with me since I started doing um, these little videos. All right, guys. I'll talk to you guys soon. Bye.